This is the elect intuitive prophetess back again with another spiritual energy read. Please subscribe to the channel. Press the like feature. Give me that thumbs up. It keeps me tapped in by permission to your current energy. All of my messages and readings are timeless. So whenever you hear it, that's when it's meant for you to apply it to your special situation. Please be advised that every read, every message is not for everybody. I may not be your preferred reader for you and that's fine because you're only going to take that which resonates and leave the rest behind. Good morning and welcome to the test, the elect soul tribe. You guys are welcome into my energetic atmosphere on this morning. I appreciate my day oneers, those that are just now coming aboard. You are absolutely fantabulous. I appreciate all the energetic exchanges and financial contributions being made towards the growth and expansion of the channel. All cross watchers are welcome. Prophets, prophetess, seers, light workers, members of the soul tribe family, members of clergy worldwide. You are welcome to this judge free zone where we do not judge anyone, but we only offer light, love, hope, and healing as we assist one another on this journey that we call life. Let's tap straight into the current energies that be. Uh, Spirit has a message uh, for you concerning a group of people, a person, or a situation that you left behind. Uh, these people are stuck. They are now stuck in the matrix, a type of a matrix, uh, due to bad choices, their bad decisions. I'm hearing years of bad choices have landed them in a predicament where I don't care what they say to you. They're stuck because if they weren't stuck, they wouldn't be in the situation that they're in. Also, be very careful of people lying to you about their situation. What I mean is narcissists have no boundaries. They have no feelings. I'm, I believe that narcissists could, could completely be soulless individuals who have literally sold their souls and switch positions or they've destiny swapped with a complete whole entire demon. These people do not care about what lie they tell you, how far they will go to hurt you just to make sure that their position stays secure, that their situation is okay. These people will lie to you to keep a roof over their heads. They will literally not only lie to you verbally, but they will lie to you through actions. What I mean is these people will hook up and pretend to be emotional just for uh to to uh soothe their sex addiction. They will pretend to care. They will literally go out of their way, even put on some type of a spiritual act or pretense to get what they want. And what I'm trying to tell you is that person that I just described, that evil type, lying, secretive person who's done a lot of dirt I'm picking up to you as well collective and that's why they're still in your energy some of them could have energetic ties to you but a tie can be undone some of these people have chained themselves to you energetically you need to do a true uh spiritual cord cutting to release these energies because they're stuck they can't manifest all of their chakras are blocked I can prove it. I have Ace of Pentacles in the upright. Number one, intuition, earth energy is here. Somebody's abundance. They can't stop your blessing, but they can delay it. Some of you are able to get away from these energies and their blessing is stuck. Some of these energies are causing your blessings to be stuck. The reason why I say that, because immediately following the Ace of Pentacles, we have the Page of Wands in the reverse. Lack of direction, procrastination. Uh, you you can't uh, you can't manifest. Your creativity is is blocked. Uh, you're limited. Your spiritual path is blocked. Mm -hmm. Even if you have new ideas, or let's say you've come up with a plan B, or you figured out how to escape, you're being held back. Everything is being delayed because of who they're tied to, who you're dealing with here. We have six of pentacle energy in the up right here. Very unrequited love, uneven. Spirit wants to come in and balance these weaks and strengths out in your life. 
these weaknesses and strengths, they need to be balanced in your world, in your life, or you wouldn't still be wanting to hold on or entertain any type of energy that's going to slow you down or block your blessings. And for those of you who are still entertaining, tied up, connected to these people, you're definitely in four of cups energy and be upright because you're not happy. You're not satisfied. You feel disconnected from these people. The universe has also tried to offer you healing. The universe offered you these a way out. They've offered these people a way out. And they didn't take it. Very emotional time for people that's still holding on to people who are stuck. I mean, I, I you know, I, I love people, relatives, friends, whoever. But if they choose to be stuck, if they choose to remain in an unrequired situation, if they choose to be unhappy, if they choose to fall victim to spell work, pray to spell work, I can't do anything about it. And the reason why I say if they choose, because the energy I'm talking about was warned on multiple occasions. The energy I'm talking about practiced so much witchcraft and sent so much evil energy out until now it's coming back in and it's nothing nobody can do to save them from it. That's another reason they're caught in the matrix due to their own bad choices. Some of these people are going to be stuck in their current present circumstance for at least the next seven to 10 years. Years because they refused to break the chain, to cut the cord. They're stuck. We have the eight of wands in the upright at the bottom of the deck. Listen, you are being blessed. You are elevating at an alarming rate, accelerated rate here is going on with the collective. Yes, speed, rapid action, movement, swift change, manifesting quickly, quick decisions, travel by air. You hear that? I'm going to read it again. Collective, you are in this energy right here. Eight of Wands in the upright. Speed, rapid action, movement, swift change, manifesting quickly, quick decisions, air travel. Mm -hmm. If you have a yes or no question at this time, this is only for the person that has a yes or no question in their mind. The answer is yes. The numbers are eight, four. We have six and we have one. See, because you move so quickly, because your manifestations, your prayers are being heard and answered rapidly, especially after this full moon energy, these people want to remain stuck to you. A lot of them, they can't. They slipped off of you like water off of a duck's back when, when these towers start falling. You were free. You walked away from this five of pentacles energy coming from these sneaky snake-like energies who are now themselves in eight of cups energy because they they stuck around and some of them stuck around the situation too long and although they're walking away they're, they're gonna experience a period of a lot of of tower tower moment tower energy is here they're stuck due to bad choices bad decisions this is not going to be a long read a lot of these people are stuck for the next seven to ten years a lot of these people you might want to stay away from them they're going to be going through karma for the next seven to ten years let's keep moving here let's get some initials here are there any hidden messages for the collective on today Holy Spirit, please give us truth and clarity as we uh, decipher any hidden messages for the collective that could be helpful for the collective on today. Why do I hear fish? Somebody's going fishing. You're on a yacht. You're on a boat. Uh, yes, you are definitely on a uh, vacation, some type of cruise, I guess, with people who are stuck. They're looking at you being hateful, but they could change their situation if they quit playing so much. San Francisco energy is here. Bay Area. I'm picking up on water energy. Q is here twice. We have the letter A, the letter S, the letter F. We have A here twice. Wow. We have uh, A here. We have uh, H. I'm sorry. We have the letter C and we have the letter C. Z here. Oh my goodness. Listen to me. Sack. Something needs to be sacked. Mm. somebody's bad decision came from who they jumped in the sack with they're stuck seven to ten years with this person i don't know if they if there's an unwanted uh, or an intentional pregnancy here 
AC is here, so I got people listening to me down south. It's hot. Mm, wherever you're located, the weather is hot. We have S-H-A. We have Shaq here. Is somebody a fan of Shaquille O'Neal? We don't have the K, but there's Shaq. You're wondering what's going on with your information on your computers. Something's missing. Something's wrong. Something ain't adding up right. The math ain't mathing on your devices. You've been hacked. I don't have the T, but I'm definitely dealing in facts on today. I don't know what why I have these two Qs here. Questions and answers, Q&A. Someone could have been involved in the Q&A or somebody has. Oh, these people that are stuck due to bad choices have questions. And you gave them an answer. You already told them what was going to happen. Now they're stuck. They, they're in a situation they cannot get out of. Simple as that. We're going to keep moving here. Any any of these initials, first, middle, last. This could be your person. This could not be your person. I don't know. This could be your situation. It may not be your situation. What I am asking you to do is share the information with those that you think may benefit from it. 11, 11 on the timer when I looked up. Let's keep going. Let's get some names, patterns. What's going on here? We're just going to do a few. I hope you guys are going to enjoy your Saturday on today. Stop waiting on stuck people. You can't save nobody that don't want to be saved. We have the color orange here. Someone could love orange and white, orange sherbet. Maybe you had some type of an orange drink. Orange Crush Pop Energy is here. Yes, uh, we have silver and we have pink here. For the colors, your name could be Sophie, Sadie, Bear, Toby, Max, May, Rocky, Buddy, Chloe, Coco, Maggie, Andrew, Brian, David, Mark. You are the Phoenix Rising. Your name could be Shirley. You could know a Cheryl. You could have some passed over ancestor energy of someone named Riley, Cheryl, Lily. We have Gray. For the color, gray is here, 50 shades of gray. Someone read that book, got all into it, went out and searched for that type of a situation. It ain't going too well now, is it? Mm -hmm. You feel like you're tied up with 50 shades of black right now. I'm telling you, you release this energy, these stuck people. Don't wait on them. They're going to pull you down. Margaret, Mary, Melissa, Mimi, Michelle, Miranda, Emmy, Emily, Emerald, Hannah, Helen, Heather, Princess is here. Whitney. Woody. Wendell. Kendall. Wallace. Wanda. Wayne. Wesley. Y'all better quit waiting on these people. We have the color black. We have Ronnie. Ronnell. Nellie. Nidra. Noor. Nate. Nancy. Nicole. Nicole. Nicolette. Nikki. And we have, I already said the color pink at the bottom of the deck. We have Emerald. And we have Tiffany. I'm telling you, y'all better don't let these people pull y'all down. They are stuck. They're literally stuck. I see an image of a rabbit hole where they made a choice to go down the rabbit hole. I see this rabbit, this little furry self is stuck trying to get out the rabbit hole. Lord have mercy. He found his way back up to the, to the light to get out of the tunnel and got stuck. Why do I hear Peter Rabbit? Let's do some locations here. Somebody got stuck in the rabbit hole. Stuck in the warm wormhole. They can't get beamed up. They're on a, a planet where, where they stuck. I, I don't know why I see Star Trek. Somebody loves Star Trek. You could be listening to me from England, Bermuda, the United Kingdom. Let's get some more locations here. You could be listening to me from Chile. Kansas, Ohio, Australia, Cuba. Wow. If you give me a shout out, I promise I'll holler back in some shape, form, or fashion. We have West Virginia, South Africa, excuse me, Israel. Grand Canyon Territory came through the other day to all my people out in Phoenix, Arizona. Give me a shout out. I promise. I'll holler back. At the bottom of the deck, we have Rhode Island. At the top, we have 
South Carolina. Let's keep it moving here. Let's put some numerology on this read. 144 on the timer. 1440 when I looked up. What are the messages, the hidden messages for the collective on today? They're stuck to the, they're due to their bad choices and bad decisions. You don't want to get stuck with them. Y'all better unleash, unchain, unblock yourselves from spirit by allowing, let these people go. They're, they're keeping you, number 13, they're not good for you. Bad luck holding on to some people because they're cursed and they don't want to change. They don't want to heal. Why connect yourself to somebody that's cursed? Look at all these number 11s. These people are about to get justice. That is their justice, being stuck. Stop trying to save people from situations that they created themselves. I'm not shocked that hangman energy is there because they're stuck. We have this empress in reverse. That's who they're stuck with. A very low vibing female who has no respect for self. All of her uh, areas are available to manipulate on her body. Did I fly low enough? That's what they're stuck to. And I know it ain't going good because we got 13 here four times. We got 14 here, 10, end of a cycle, the number seven. They had a way out and they didn't take it. We have Cancer, Virgo, Libra, Scorpio, Capricorn energy is here. Mm -hmm. You could have a birth date of January the 13th, October the 13th, October the 10th, October the 5th, May the 4th, July the 14th, July the 11th, July the 12th energy is here very strong. Cancer energy Feminine energy of someone who does not have any self-respect, no self-esteem. We have 19 at the bottom, which is another 10, and we have 8. They're stuck to their karma. Mm -hmm, they can't get out. They went down this wormhole, this rabbit hole, following addictions, uh, greed, lust, money. It's not working out. You, you, you really need to... I guess Spirit is still trying to get a lot of you all to let go of these low-vibing individuals. That was the numerology portion. Let me pull out some one-liners here. Who are these people that made bad choices? What's going on with them? They're stuck. The next 7 to 10 years, you're going to get information coming in about their situation. They're trying to hold on to you because they see your blessings. They see your success. Their secrets are coming out. They were full of doubt. This emperor in reverse. We just had the empress in reverse. So whatever situation they're in, it's not good. There's a lot of fighting. There's a lot of arguing. There is a lot of abusive activity between this Virgo and this Cancer energy. And it's true. Somebody needs to run. Because <laughs> somebody is stuck due to their bad choices. I hope that I said something that resonates with someone. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. It would be greatly appreciated. Until next time, collectives. Bye-bye.